For the last 20 years, technology has made a promise. You don't need to own anything. Movies became streams, music became playlists, software became subscriptions, even your files stopped living with you. And then AI arrived and skipped ownership entirely. No installation, no permanence, just monthly fees and someone else holding the keys. But what if intelligence didn't have to be rented? What if AI behaved less like a website and more like a personal machine? Not something you log into, but something you grow. This is a Laris One, a desktop-sized system designed to bring artificial intelligence back home, physically, privately, and permanently. Inside its minimalist aluminum body is the kind of hardware you'd normally find in a $4,000 Creator laptop, a 24-core Intel Core Ultra 9 processor, an NVIDIA RTX 5090 mobile GPU with 24 gigabytes of VRAM, 96 gigabytes of memory, all tuned not for portability, but for sustained performance. This isn't a thin client, it's a workstation. But hardware is only half the story. Alaris runs on an open source operating system that turns the device into a personal cloud without the cloud. Over 200 apps deployable with a single click, local language models, AI agents, search engines, automation tools, monitoring dashboards, no terminal gymnastics, no dependency hell. Everything runs locally. Everything stays yours. This is where AI changes character. You train it on your documents, your archives, your creative habits. It remembers not because a company stores it, but because you do. Lower latency, complete privacy, no token meters ticking in the background. An assistant that feels less rented and more cultivated. And unexpectedly, it's also a gaming server. Install your library once, stream it anywhere. Your own cloud gaming platform without queues, usage limits, or monthly bills. Just hardware doing what hardware does best. Here's the real shift. Cloud AI makes you a tenant. Access is conditional. Costs scale forever. Olaris flips that equation. You pay once. You own the system. You control the intelligence. In a world racing towards rented cognition, Olaris One asks a quieter, more radical question. What if the future of AI isn't in the cloud, but on your desk?